just to clean it up, you would have taken me out. Guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel fam. I got another great compilation for you guys today. I hope you guys do enjoy. If so, be sure to comment down below and slap a like on it. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you so much and enjoy again. Peace. This biker pulled up to a light and waited there patiently like any good little biker does until a Mustang, funny enough, plows through the red light. King We got another good biker here just waiting at the red light patiently when all of a sudden some lady came right from behind him and nearly took him out. This is why you always, always check behind you even multiple times just in case. Holy shit. Oh my god. Holy fuck. Are you okay? Your tires definitely- This biker is enjoying his fun ride on some back roads when it looks like he sees a wet patch in the road. He then tries to avoid it by taking a wide turn, but that doesn't really end well for him. Check it out. In this clip guys, we got some biker on biker action. Let me know who you think was in the wrong here, if anyone at all. Um, you can clearly you see how Prince Meerkat just does, does not like any cyclists taking up the whole road. Um, this one was kind of fighting against him a little yeah, bit, but do. let me know what you guys think. Are you stupid guys? It's gonna crash on the roads, dude. This group of riders is enjoying their tail of dragon ride when unfortunately one rider takes his turn just a little too tight compared to his fellows in front of him and ends up going down. This clip is crazy guys, but let me know what you guys think in the comments down below on how Ferris handles this situation. Obviously the car is at fault, but just watch.
moments later. That was unbelievably stupid. You almost took me out. You almost took me out. If I hadn't anticipated that, if I hadn't anticipated that, listen to me. If I hadn't anticipated that, you would have taken me out. This is life and death. You have got a 3,000 pound bullet you're driving. You nearly killed me. That is a 3,000 pound bullet. Now, are you listening? I don't think you listened to a word I said. You ran a red light and nearly took me out. It was red for you. You're going to kill somebody. This clip just goes to show why you always have to be so careful when lane splitting because situations like these are hard to predict and react to. Everyone said my friend Spengali said... And just like the last clip, even though lane splitting is legal in some places, it does not make it 100% safe. Some people just blatantly can't see you um, or don't notice you, so you just have to be that much more careful. Whoa! Woo! The show must go on, ladies and gentlemen. And that was my fault, because, see, they don't see you kind of coming down here like this. However, unlike the last clip, this driver is totally at fault. No excuses not to see the biker here. Um, as you can kind of hear at the beginning of the crash, you'll hear the driver trying to blame the biker, which is totally crazy. Luckily for the biker, he was okay and he had it all on film just in case. Um, this is literally why we ride with cameras on. I hope you guys did learn something from this video today and I thank you guys so much for watching and supporting every one of my videos. I will have a new video out for you guys next Friday, so stay tuned and I'll see you then. Peace.